was the only person responsible for the Christmas Day bombing in Nashville, and that he died in the explosion, according to the BBC. The initial theory is that Warner managed to concoct a powerful bomb and place it in his RV. He then drove the RV bomb to downtown Nashville on Christmas morning and parked it right next to an AT&T transmission building on 2nd Avenue North at 1.22 a.m. Residents were woken up by the sound of around 20 gunshots between 5.11 a.m. and 5.26 a.m. Police responded to the area at about 6 a.m. and heard a warning coming from a loudspeaker on the RV. The voice warned of a bomb in the vehicle and told people to evacuate, while also counting down the minutes before detonation. The bomb exploded at 6.29 a.m., severely damaging the AT&T transmission building and knocking out data services in five states. Warner is known to have had extensive experience in IT work. Media reports say the FBI asked Warner's acquaintances if he was paranoid about 5G technology and believed theories that 5G was being used to spy on people.